Hi guys, today I want to review the Structural Engineering Formulas book. I got this book for around $20. Uh, this is an older ed edition. It's by Ilya Mikkelson. Mikkelson? Something like that? I don't know. Uh, if you get the newer version, it's like $100, so I decided to go for the older version. It's a great book. It's a great, great book. Uh, it, can ba it basically has formulas for everything. So, let's go over it a little bit. So if you if you look at it, you're gonna see like the formula for whatever you want. Like for example, uh, for tension and compression, for stress and strain. And one thing that I really like, like it's it just straight to the point. It it doesn't torsional structures and stuff like that. It tells you everything you need to know. Uh, well, not everything you need to know, but it tells you the most important things that you need to know. Simple beams. Oh, sorry, the other way. So it's a really nice book. I've been using it a lot of work. Uh, instead of like thinking, oh my God, where do I look? Do I need to go to the steel code, to the building code, to whatever? Just go here or do I need to use this book that I had in college? You just go here and there, that's it. And even like it has some really nice examples, as you can see. And it guides you through the process of, some, of something very simple. It's a really, really great, great book. Let me go into the, the context. So it has structural analysis, statics, and it tells you how to do frames, arch, trusses, plates. It also has like soils and foundation formula for soils, foundations, uh, retaining structures, pipes and tunnels. And it's a really, really, really good book. And for $15, or well, $20 plus ship, including the shipping, it's, I think it's a great deal. I, I really, really recommend this book. I love it. And it's very portable, so you can just take it on your hand or take it anywhere. And you can even take it on site and just be reading on it. And it's really just a good book to have. Just to, even if you don't use these formulas, it's good to review them for the PE exam, for the EIT exam. Or even if you're an undergrad student, this book will help you a lot. Uh, this is a great book.